What's up, everyone? It's me, CN Skaima, and welcome to CN Figures. Figures in your house. And for this tour review, we're going to look at the Fortnite action figure Galaxy by Jasper. You can see the figure right here inside the package with all the accessories that he comes with. Right there in the top, Fortnite and the name of the character. And right here in the front, we get a picture of the character and it looks so good. And we also get in both sides of the package, longer with the name of the game and also here in the back side. And you can see there's all the figures in the set that you guys can collect. There's nothing in the top side or in the bottom side. So enough chatting. Let's take him out. And here's the figure out of his box. And wow, this guy looks so cool. Take a good look at the paint apps. They're amazing and all clean. And I see they use both light and dark color all around the body. And also has some unique detail that I really like on this figure. We've seen this piece before, but it shares the exact same paints like the figure, light and dark color all around it. And also has some unique detail like stars from out of space. Now that is very nice. He also comes with this pack of dynamite and this looks so great. I love the red color and we get a little bit of dark colored gray around here in the top and the bottom. And a little bit light colored gray right here in the tip. I have no idea what this is, but I can tell that you can attach it on the back. You can see the peg right there, but look in the back side. I like this color and you can see some unique detail. And I believe right here in the front, they mix some colors up. Like you see some light colored gray mixed up with dark colored blue all around it. And we get a little bit of yellow with some faded colors all around in the middle. And this effect, it looks so good. I believe there are shooting stars flying all around the figure's head. I love the unique color. And you can see the stars right there in each tip around it. We get the exact same piece, just like the Medea's shadow figure I reviewed before. But this one is all painted with black and brown. The exact same model and also has the exact same sculpting all around it. He also comes with this gun, but I believe I seen this model before, but I don't know where. And you can see he has some sculpting in both sides with this gray color and a little bit black color right there in the bottom. We also get two changeable faces and these, they look great. And I believe this one has his mouth open like he's blowing. And I believe this one, he's all happy, but still they look great. And here's Galaxy again. And the head sculpt of this guy is incredible because they added this light silver color all around it, like the eyebrows, the beard, and especially on the hair. And look at that. The sculpting is great. And you can see the peg right there in the back of his head. And right there, you can attach the shooting stars effect. And I don't know what to say. I think this one's the best one that Jazzware ever made. And the ears are too small to see in each side of the head. But it does has a little bit of dark purple around it. And I think they use some type of materials on the face. And the eyes is too small to see the color. But I think they use a little bit of light or dark color gray or blue or uh, probably mix it up some colors around there and it does has a little bit of wrinkles the nose came out okay same thing for the lips full beard and the eyebrows are all sculpted you can see a little bit of detail like stars like you see it outside in the night i believe this is his vendetta that he has around his neck and you can see some sculpting all around it but in the back only shows a little bit and I didn't even imagine that this figure would be that good because his body mold is all covered in stars. And like I said in the beginning of the video, they use both light and dark color on this guy. And around the waist, you can see a little bit of belt design, 
with some black color around it with some sculpting and I believe they use some type of material because I feel like plastic here but still it looks good and you can see some detail around the waist like some wrinkles around it and you can see another vendetta right here attached on his arm here I don't know what type of gray color to use on the fingers in each hand but they look so good you can see all the fingers sculpted very great especially the thumb and you can see he has gloves and you can see in the back of each one has a little bit of detail and a little bit more in the back side of the hand and you can see more sculpting around in each wrist of this guy I think this guy has muscles on the legs and we get more wrinkles and this side of his pants but not this one not that much and I really like the added these parts on the legs or on the boots and we get more black color around here in the bottom more straps in the back more detail in each foot around but now I'm thinking about it I think I seen this body mode before but I can't remember what figure but even if it's a reused body mold, I love the design and the paints are so good and all clean all around it. Like I said, I didn't even imagine that this figure would be that good. Now, let's get on with its articulation. You can move his head side to side, a complete rotation. He can look down just a little bit, but not up. He can look straight and he has no butt joint. He can open his arms this much. He has a butterfly joint, bicep swivel, rotation each one, and we get some double jointed around the elbows, wrist articulation, you can bend it back and forth, you can open his fingers, and he has some torso articulation, you can bend it back and forth, and has no butt joint, waist articulation, you can open his legs this much, you can kick a lot, in the front and a little bit on the back leg rotation we get some double joint around the knee rotation around this part of the leg we get some ankle articulation and extra articulation around here comparing size but further see how tall this figure stands he stands just exactly six inches tall here he is with my sentinel figure and I think sentinel he stands a little bit taller than him. Here he is with my other fortnite figure trip and I believe galaxy stands a little bit taller than him. Here he is with my SPD red ranger and I think these two figures they stand the exact same height. And here he is with my fur marvel celeb Thanos. And there you have it guys. They put a lot of bunch of amazing work on this figure. Everything came out wonderful. I really love the paint apps, the special effects that this guy comes. I think this one was the best one that Jasper ever made. Okay guys, that's all for today. So thank you for watching today's review. I hope you enjoy it. If you did, leave a like. If you want to share it, go ahead, be my guest. Comment, but remember to not leave any offensive comments or saying bad words. If you do that, your comment will be removed from this video. And subscribe to the channel for more videos in the future, like toy reviews, toy hunts, unboxing videos. Because right now, I got a package from Big Bad Toy Store. I bought a NECA figure. If you guys want to know what figure it is, you can leave your guess on the comments, okay? And please follow my Facebook page, CM Figures. Follow me on Twitter and follow me on Instagram. And I'll catch you guys on the next video. So take care, be safe, keep on hunting, keep on collecting. This is CN Skyima and Galaxy. And we're out in line. See you next time, guys.